This is my top 10 most anticipated movies coming out this summer. So if you guys didn't know by now, there are a ton of movies dropping this summer and a lot of them I am excited for. So I gathered a list of my top 10 for you guys right now. Before we get into the list, make sure you guys hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for some more juicy, juicy videos, as well as follow all my socials linked in the bio. You guys can catch up on all my social medias. I would appreciate it. And without further ado, let's get into the list. Let's go. Starting off with my number 10 spot, I have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem. Now for a good portion of my childhood, I watched a lot of Nickelodeon's TMNT. It was awesome. And then they came out with the movies and I was like, okay, okay, let's just take a step back. But for Mutant Mayhem, it looks amazing. The cartoons, the graphics, the teenage actors, it's intriguing, man. And I'm so freaking pumped. Next up on my list, I have the brand new Barbie movie. Now for the most part, I've never been interested in Barbie dolls in my childhood at all. But this movie has a stacked cast and it looks like an absolute freaking blast. I'm going to this on opening night and I'm going to laugh my freaking ass off because it's going to be hilarious. The teaser trailer or the trailer that we already got was so funny and i cannot wait for this movie on the big screen also margot robbie's feet am i right <laughs> who's that guy back there next up on my list i have the flash now to be fair i do not like dc whatsoever superman is okay batman is the only good thing in my opinion about dc happening right now, now the flash i'm excited for because back when i was a little kid i like he was my favorite dc superhero that's all i watched on i think boomerang it was on i'm not sure if that was on there or not but that's besides the point i just loved the flash i know there's all that drama with ezra miller still and and that's i'm not even talking about that right now but i'm just kind of curious where dc is going and its direction is because i hope i hope they can make this movie good I really do. But uh, some of the screenshots got me a little bit worried. At sixth place on our list, we have Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny. Harrison Ford's last Indiana Jones film? Probably. I mean, probably, but they always say that they end up coming back. But the man is getting up there in age, and I think that he has to take a little break from this franchise. There's not much to say. All the Indiana Jones films are really, really good. I hope that this movie can live up to the hype. I really do. I'm so freaking excited for it. Hearing that theme in the trailers just got me super freaking hype. Can't wait for this film. That's, that's all I gotta say. Moving on to fifth place, we have Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning Part 1. I've always loved the Mission Impossible films. They're great. A lot of action. Tom Cruise is nuts with the stunts. I just love them. I'm excited for this film. I can't wait till we get the full trailer. It is going to be epic. Moving on to number four, we have Oppenheimer. Christopher Nolan is gonna do this film justice, man. This film is going to be amazing. It is going to be amazing. That's enough said enough said this could be the best movie of the year if, if they do it right like this movie is going to be sick can't wait for it it's going to be an amazing film moving on to the fourth place we have dc's blue beetle i am so excited to see sholo play another role in a new movie we've seen him as miguel from cobra kai kicking karate ass but now we're going to see him in this type of dc's version of a venom symbiote basically but turning into a blue beetle it looks nuts this movie is going to have some sick action some sick comedy some it's just gonna be a good movie or 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 at least i hope so dc please don't let me down again very excited for this film that's why it's on my number four spot i, I just cannot wait i literally love love sholo this movie is literally gonna be epic moving into my top three spots this one you might not expect for my top three but i gotta go with disney's haunted mansion movie now it's not the haunted mansion it's haunted mansion and it's based off the disney ride i love when they do the attraction rides for movies because it's awesome like it it's so good i love the haunted mansion ride whenever i go to disney world now yes i do live in wisconsin so it's pretty far uh i'm pretty far up north from disney world but when i do go i love disney disney like makes me feel like a kid again and, and that ride is just so awesome. But every time I go on it, it seems to break down. That's fine. Uh, Disney, please sponsor this video. So uh, uh, you can take me there and I can ride it when it's not broken. But like I said, this cast is stacked. Super excited for this movie. Moving on. Another interesting topic that you guys might not agree on, but at the number two spot, I have Transformers Rise of the Beasts. Ever since I was a kid, I was a huge fan of the Michael Bay Transformers. Those movies are sick. Those movies are are so fun i love them the action's a little overpowering sometimes thank you thank you michael bay but the shia labeouf ones and the mark Wahlbergs, I, I just love those movies the action's intense peter collins as optimus prime is epic and i cannot wait to hear his voice in this movie it's going to be sick definitely one of my most anticipated movies of the summer 
I cannot wait. But at the number one spot for my most anticipated movie this summer, you guys probably already guessed it at this point, but it's Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse. I am beyond stoked for this movie. The trailers have been amazing. They haven't showed much, but they've showed a decent amount. Starting to get the plots of this movie, what's going to be happening to Miles Morales, and I just... I literally cannot wait. The music's going to be epic. The fighting is going to be epic. The animation is going to be epic. This movie is going to win some awards guaranteed. But that's my list of my top 10 anticipated movies of the summer. If you guys have a top 10 list, leave them down below in the comment section. I would love to see them, read them, talk about them, talk with you guys about them. Let me know if you enjoyed the video. If you guys enjoy this type of content, I also want to know down in the comment section. But yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.